Happy birthday to you. <laughs> so it's 5.30 in the morning. So we've made it to Dublin Airport and Patty surprised me, even though it's his birthday today, with a lounge experience before our flight to Doha and then Dubai. I'm zooming in. Love you. <laughs> so Patty is the sneakiest ever and upgraded us to first class. Oh my goodness. I've never flown first class in my life. I got myself. This baby is so happy right now. <laughs> happy birthday to me as well. <laughs> it's also a and to join us in our journey. This is my little birthday. I'm going to any donation made on board. I'm to air We had a really quick layover in Doha and ordered, I <laughs> you know, I forgot, but I put it on my Instagram. I got sushi and scallops to share with Patty and he got a Wagyu steak and he gave me some of it. It was so good. We're gonna go hide and live here. <laughs> now our final flight to Dubai. There's shuttle buses. And, and there's, there's first class shuttle buses. There's shuttle buses. Are you getting used to this? <laughs> Don't. <laughs> Like, I didn't know this existed. Like you get checked into your shuttle bus. Imagine you had a private jet. Like, I thought, it? I knew we had a connected flight. Where my brain work was, oh, that's so great, Patty. Like upgraded for the first bit. And then I was like, okay, we'll be 36 e for the last little flight. And Patty's like, no, it's the whole thing. <laughs> I've never flown first class. This is like, I didn't know this existed. A shuttle bus in Virtualness. Definitely did not know that existed. From Line Jackson's. Very good. This is like people's norm. We made it to our hotel room, and my goodness, we have a walk in closet. Obviously, toilets are in there. There's a massive shower here. Massive bath. There's chandeliers everywhere. This cool little detail. And then the room. Are you joking me? It's like the nicest room I've ever stayed in. It's so fancy. This is the, I think I said, did I say the raffles? We've got a room upgrade all through Voyage, Voyage Privé. Patty found it last minute literally two weeks ago. 50% off or else we would not have been able to stay here, but my goodness. So fancy. <laughs> okay, you can come now. <laughs> Our stay comes with half board, so we're gonna do breakfast and dinner, but because we arrived at like 10 30 p.m., even though we're used to four hours prior, so 6 30, we had dinner included for tonight, but we asked if we could get it as room service because I could not be around people, I'm so tired. So I got the Reuben sandwich, which looks amazing, even the plate is hot. Pastrami, sauerkraut pickles, that kind of thing. Patty, did you get two <laughs> chips? Well, it looks like he did. Strawberry milkshake and a cheeseburger. These pickles look so good. Good morning, everybody. How stunning is the Rafael lobby? My goodness. Beautiful. Everything is gold and tastefully done. There's always a piano player at night. I'm gonna go get some breakfast. So we're exhausted. <laughs> it's four hours ahead here, so I had my alarm set for 8:30, which is 4:30. We didn't fall asleep till one. So 
had like enough hours of sleep, but we're tired. This is the breakfast I went for. How do we love it? It's a little bit of an you know, Arabic moment. Hash brown, scrambled eggs, fruit, a little Greek yogurt, and granola, and pudding is sugar. Sugar. You just like what you like with a casual falcon behind you. Great. <laughs> We just came back to the room to get changed because we are now heading to Atlantis. Yes, for ice cream. For ice cream. Let's go get ice cream. So we made it to Atlantis, not the new one, like the original. And I got a yogurt. Is it called yogurt berry or frozen berry? Oh, frozen berry. Frozen berry. It's um, frozen yogurt, granola with fruit. And Patty got cold stone, the cheese, hey. cheesecake with lots of fruit and white chocolate. It's so healthy. His is so good, but so healthy. I didn't want my stomach. Oh, we can get a toy in here for Oscar. Um, I didn't want my stomach to hurt before dinner because of the dairy. So we went with yogurt. Hopefully it doesn't hurt. And look at the look at the stingray. Oh, you missed it. Oh, I missed okay. it. Zoom in. They're so happy. That girl's getting such good pictures of the stingray. Look at that one. <laughs> the kids would love this. Look at that. Wait. <laughs> Sticking his tongue back. We are all dressed, ready for dinner. I've done my makeup a little bit more dramatic than the usual. The eyeliner and lipstick's a little bit more dramatic. Earrings are refi. This little bag is a vintage number I took from my mom's closet like 10 years ago. <laughs> and then hair, I literally just threw it up into a ponytail and braided it. It's kind of falling apart, so I might have to do that again because that's going to annoy me. And then this dress, let me turn you around, from Naked, and AKD, And it's pretty much to the floor. These shoes are vinted and they're so cute. Little heel. Really comfy. Can you take it? Can you take it? Yes! That's so comfy! Another day, another breakfast buffet. <laughs> Oh, this is so good. You have to get a little pita and then you put all the toppings on. That's my favorite. I'm gonna go with a little pita. The bread, maybe? Okay, I've perfected my breakfast routine. Fresh watermelon, granola with like flaxseed, pistachio, Greek yogurt. One hash brown, so the hash browns, scrambled eggs, and then these Arabic pitas with, I don't know what it's called, so I don't want to mess it up, but it's like beans, Greek yogurt, and this mild chutney and parsley. It is so good. Oh, my favorite. We're at the Dubai Mall, the largest mall in the world. And this is, I don't know, because we've never been here before, but it's very grand. Every store so far. Where have you been? Huh? Where have you been? So far. It got me. It's a surprise. Anything of note? I got the summer Friday sweet no, mint. Of where we are. Oh. <laughs> That's really nice. Uh, this is the Dubai Mall. We already said that. Is that the tallest building? Is it? So we're back from Dubai Mall, and I don't know if we let you know, but our toilet clogged two days in a row, which is not the end of the world, but here in Dubai, they give you an upgrade, full room upgrade, because it just can't be not perfect enough. Why are you looking at me? Because <laughs> it only clogged after you used it both days in a row. Anyways, this room is insane. 
has a couch, there's a, a lot more space. And then we're on the other side of the hotel now, which shows the palm where we had ocean view before, which is lovely, but it's nice to get a different view. It's really pretty. Honestly, all views here are gorgeous. Desk, everything's the same. The color's different, it's less blue, more gold. Obviously, a little living area. Walk out porch, which we had in the other one. And then there's just more of a hallway, I guess, to the bathroom, the bath, the toilet, all that stuff, walk-in closet, which is pretty much all the same, if not exactly the same. But we're off to the pool, only for a couple hours, because it's already 3.30, maybe 3.45. That's the travel hack. Yep. To the big pool. Oh my made it to dinner. Patty had a call with the marketing team because they were four hours behind. So I got ready while he took that. And tonight we're in the Japanese restaurant. What's it called again? Mitagi? Something like that. It's a part of the Raffles restaurants and the four option. You get like a, a set menu or 20% off of the a la carte menu. <sighs> My hair is an I shouldn't have washed it because I spent so long blow drying it, overheating because it's so hot. And then I check my air wrap, which does work in the Middle East because they're all UK outlets, so that was handy. But my hair is always like a bit frizzier and like, I don't know, crazier on the days I wash it. So I obviously don't have all my hair products here to tame it. Spent so long like trying to strain it with my round brush for no reason. But tomorrow it will be good. Not that anyone cares. First starters are these rolls. Hadi got like a two prawn version and I got a shell avocado which looks so pretty. I'm really excited for this. It was very, very nice, and I'm very appreciative of it. <laughs> He's annoyed because no, I'm not he annoyed. misread the... The girl talking? <laughs> she thought Didn't make it clear? Um, no, but it was so good. The sushi was... Excuse me. Oh, my digestion. The sushi there was, was a set menu, which was <laughs> included. Not over this. But we went off menu. They said, Thinking okay, we could you, get our... Allowance, allowance, which deducted. is 295 plus 20% 20 off a la carte. So we thought that was the case, but it was just 20% a la carte. So it was a 150 pound meal. No. Which back home, it would have been a very small, <laughs> expensive meal, but it was so good still. And the company, even back, good thing we did not have drinks. Good thing I'm pregnant. <laughs> Saved us a lot of zeros. <laughs> just spell. No, what else can I do for you? <laughs> then we went to the lobby and listened to the beautiful pianist. <laughs> I laughed too hard. I go to the bathroom and read it. Thank you. Thank you. Um, and then we came back to the room. And the lady, the sweet lady, was doing the turn down service. Um, turn down for what? Oh, God. <laughs> okay. We have not vlogged today because. All we've done is get breakfast and lay by the pool. But now we're gonna go have a little adventure. We're gonna go to Atlantis Royal. I keep calling it Atlantis One and Only, but there's Atlantis, ooh, the like main one at the center of the palm, and then Royal's the new one that Beyonce performed at, what, last year? So this is my little get up. It's definitely a beach cover up, but I have a bodysuit underneath. And it's really cute in the back. And it's obviously bump friendly. And today we are 33 weeks. So we've made it to Atlantis Royal, which is royal. There's a Louis Vuitton store right when you walk in. I think there's a Dolce and Gabbana event over there. I think that's a restaurant. Lamar, I'm guessing another restaurant. There's Valentino. It's definitely a luxury personified. Don't you think? 
No? Yeah. Where's Beyonce? She's like 18 months late. <laughs> so pretty. I think it's like fountains. Or there must be a restaurant down there, yeah. I feel like this resort especially is geared towards young adults, couples. There's definitely a younger vibe here than there is at the original Atlantis, which is very family focused. This one's only, I think, two years old, I believe. But it is really gorgeous. Patty's here. Afternoon. Afternoon. We just have to bend over. If I can bend over with the baby, you can bend over. We have just chilled this morning. I didn't feel too great after our walk. We went for a walk on the boardwalk, which was lovely, but I think the heat and overconsumption of food has just made me feel a little, little. I just kind of rested while Patty had his breakfast and he said he had the eggs benedict with eggs salmon benedict. and it was so good so good so good perfect eggs then met up with him went to the pool and we've just been reading or listening to podcasts just chilling and now we're having lunch at one of the restaurants here piatti and having something like just fresh and light not like smorgasbord buffet version because we're going to go into dubai mall the fountains because during Ramadan the fountain show isn't on during the day but it is from six and we really want to see it apparently it's cool. so that's the plan for our last evening here and then a very early morning flight to Italy for work tomorrow does this not look the yummiest oh my goodness lobster pasta there's nothing in that that's just for decoration Patty got a spicy salami pizza and calamari just Got ready for our little dinner out. Patty is doing some work and I am feeling the sun. I think it was a little much today, even though I was like always kept like my top half in the shade. I'm definitely feeling tired and lethargic, so I've got some electrolytes. We're gonna head into Dubai Mall soon to see the fountain and then probably get a bite to eat out there. The skyline though. It is beautiful. It's really clear today. That's actually Piatti right there at the beach. And that's where you'd have the buffet every night down there. It's been quite misty the last, or foggy the last couple of days, but today it's quite clear. And then, I don't think you can see from our room because of these villas, but oh, maybe like just in between those two villas. You can see a pokey out building that's really tall. That's the Burj Khalifa, tallest building in the world. But you'll see, well, you already saw it whenever we went the other day. We'll see it again tonight. On we go. We have 20 minutes. <laughs> you can talk if you want. I can't talk. <laughs> I'm just trying to be mysterious. Oh. <laughs> What well, fancy place in Dubai did we end up at, Alana? Uh, you got all dressed up for. I get dressed up for anything. Although... I'm here for the fountain show that... Everyone thinks is happening, or should have happened 15 minutes ago. It isn't happening for another 45. So we thought, let's get some food. My stomach was a little weird today, so I was like... I want food I know my stomach won't react to, especially because we have an early and a long flight tomorrow at the back of the plane. <laughs> back to reality. So, five guys of this. All right, we have made it to. There's a hair 
on the lens. Bologna, Italy, and we are literally like 10 minutes from the hotel, hotel, airport. A little bit of a room change, <laughs> back to porridge as they say. It was a long travel day. We were up at six in the morning to get our flight for nine, and I just took a really weird like nerve pain in my back, like under like my shoulder, what's this called, potty? And I couldn't like get rid of it, and it was, Shoulder really blade. shoulder blade that's it really toying with my mental like capacity i didn't sleep like perfectly last night because you know when you know you have to wake up especially for a flight you don't ever go into like a deep sleep slash i wake up twice a night anyways to go to the bathroom so i think i was a little not at my mentally strongest so i had a little cry on the plane because i was just in so much pain but thankfully it did not last the whole Plane flight, Patty was an angel, as usual. I cried too, so. <laughs> he cried with me in sympathy. Um, I did sleep because I was tired. I think I was really tired mixed with some pain, which is never great. Anyways, we're here for Cosmoprof, for Pearl Beauty. We're now in work mode. Okay, camera died, so I'm just quickly ending this vlog. I hope you enjoyed, and stay tuned for the next video. Bye.